Hey guys, my name is Drew, welcome back to another video on the Infinity SMP, aka Waiting for Hightail. And today, this is going to be either episode 2 or 3. I don't know if I'm going to show me and Dragon Mining. I might, or might not. I don't know. Dude, just give me some diamonds already! It's not how it works. So how yes, does it dude, work? Dude, just give me some redstone already, and then you get diamonds. Dude, just give me some coal! I really need some coal, dude. Oh, it gave me coal. That's awkward. Dragon, come. That that's really awkward. It that see it it, it does work how I <laughs> I actually got oh. coal and, and some iron. <laughs> okay, since that since that worked, dude, just let me find some diamonds, bro. Like I really need some diamonds, dude. Redstone. I found diamonds. <laughs> I found diamonds. I, I found, found redstone. Diamonds. Dude, I actually found diamonds. So that means yours is gonna work since I found I wanted diamonds and I found redstone. You said if I say redstone, I'll find diamonds. So I really want some red. <laughs> you found redstone, didn't no, you? No, I found diamonds. Wait, really? This is a joke. 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 That no, can't be real. that's that a joke. Can't be real. It's it's gonna be it's it's an A vein. Wait, really? No, it's not an A vein. It's what vein? Um, my head hurts now. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's pretty good. If I didn't show you it, or if you didn't watch it, um, this is the stuff I have now. Just to get you caught up with ten diamonds. Woo, fun. We got a. Uh, some food here that I collected, some bees, which we'll get into a little bit, and then I have some machines here from Ender.io, which is connected to the energy conduits up here, and then through here, I have this connected to a basic capacitor bank, which holds storage, and that goes up to, this is a solar panel, and then there's uh, eight more solar panels up there on the roof that I really can't show you because I can't like fly up there or anything, but uh, yeah, it's basically all I've done. Then I made over their little farm area with, what do you see? A beehive. Yes, that is a beehive. So what I actually need to do is I actually need to grab one of these flowers real quick. And you know what? We'll grab these as well. But so we need to go down here. And apparently I looked up forestry. So I actually haven't said anything about this. But uh, I started to kind of learn how to do forestry mod and stuff with the bees. And try and like collect honey and stuff and farm honey so I kind of researched a little bit and uh, I got like all the car I got the carpenter right here which I don't really know what it does but then I got a squeezer here which this has seed oil and it does something I don't know but it really this really needs to get a lot more power but this is a bee house oh it has produced oh so okay so when i was off you put a princess here and a drone here and it takes away the drone and makes this a queen and then over time i'll do it here again it there it breeds this will go away and it'll make a queen so now i'll say the bees are melting and the heat here and unable to work use a habitat locator to find a cooler climate okay so now it's too hot here, and I need a habitat locator. So I need more bronze and redstone. I probably have that by now, let's be honest. But uh, yeah, so this is good. This is good. So whatever I did actually worked. Um, none of you know what I'm talking about, but I went through like trial and error trying to figure out how to get the bees to actually like breed and stuff. So now I have honeycomb, and so I can use that honeycomb with... Maybe the centrifuge? I don't remember which one it's called. But I can use that to turn to honey drops, and then I can use the honey drops and make that, help that to make some food, so I can supply myself with food. Um, what was I doing? I've really been losing my mind today. I have no clue what I came up here for. Like, I've been losing my mind today. What did I come up here for? Cooler climate. Bronze ingots. Yes. Okay, let's do that. So, that's copper. I need bronze. I don't have any bronze. We need four, so that's fine. Copper, you put one ten in there. Three copper, boom. Four bronze ingots, and then we need a piece of redstone. Bada bing. Bada boom. 
There we go, habitat locator. Okay. So do we just right click this? And it current biome, extreme hills, temperature cold, humidity normal. Oh, okay, so it have to be it depends on what biome we're in. So river, normal, normal. And then plains. Is it gonna say hot? No, it's not. Interesting. So throughout the plains biome, does it get too hot? Interesting. It doesn't say anything about it being too hot. But let me go ahead and sleep real quick with my sleeping bag. I'm trying to figure this out as quick as I can because I really want to figure this out. So if I right click this, oh, habitat locator. Nothing to analyze. Supply a specimen to analyze. Honey required. This gadget requires honey drops or honeydew for operation. Is that what the carpenter's for? How do I get honey drops? I put it in the centrifuge. Okay, so that's what I do. I put it in the centrifuge. So I do this. And then, what do I do again? I do, I just put it in there. But yeah, I saw this thing where apparently you need flowers and it helps the bee to do something. Um, it's a habitat locator, find a cooler climate. This gadget requires honey drops or honeydew for operation. Apply a specimen. So I need to get honey drops. Oh, it's working. I think it's because it doesn't have power. Okay, it's working. Okay. So let me just quickly yes yeah, on insert. Okay. So this is working. Okay, so while it's doing that, I'm gonna go do some other stuff, like uh farm up this wheat right here. And uh get some other stuff going while that's making the honey drops. Okay, so we got some strawberries here. Let's go ahead and expand that. I wanted to get started on Tinker's Construct because I actually haven't started on Tinker's Construct yet because I do not know. Um, is there like an area with a bunch of sand? There might, I haven't explored this area yet. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Let me go ahead and put some of this stuff away so I don't have like my inventory cluttered with stuff. So I'm gonna put most of the stuff in my chests and then I'm gonna go ahead and explore the savannah biome. And uh, I'll see you guys when I go ahead and do that. Okay guys, so I see the savannah right there, but there's a forest hive that I need to get rid of real quick here. There we go, got some more drones and a princess so I can breed those two together and get uh, another queen if I need to. But uh, yeah, and these hives are from Panzer Archive, those don't do anything. But uh, here's the savannah biome. Uh, I wanted to see if there was actually like a desert behind this and I could get a bunch of sand for making grout for the Tinker's Construct smeltery. But it looks like actually there's a bunch of cows here. There's a lot of cows here. Wow, there's a lot of cows here. It doesn't look like there's like a desert behind this or anything. It doesn't look like there's anything behind this. It looks like it's just an ocean. But um, yeah. Oh, there's a little bit of a plains over there looks like. So yeah, let's go explore this and see what happens. Oop, a little bit of lag back there. Probably on my end. Ooh, modest hive. Let's see what we get from this. Oh, we got uh, a comb. So if it's modest, does that mean it needs to be hotter or colder? Or like modest, meaning around normal? Like, I, I, I don't know, man. I'm just guessing. I should have brought my... um my compass with me the, the the thing i just made and see what it says that biome is if it's like hot or something it probably says hot like let's be honest it probably says hot this is a desert biome right that has to be a desert biome that has to be a desert biome yes it is that's a desert biome let's go actually extends i've never seen a desert biome do this it extends all the way out here and then just randomly i'm gonna do some cactus for the road because I can grow some cactus, but while I do this, I'm going to gather some sand and explore a little bit more 
and sleep as well because it's just during nighttime. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna go do all that, and I will see you guys once again. Hey, there's a beehive right there. I'll go mine that as well. But uh, yeah, I will see you guys back. Yeah, I'll, I'll see you guys in a second. Actually, I won't see you guys back because I just broke that hive and found something very interesting. So I found a violent drone. So it was a modest one, but I got a violent drone. Now I don't know what those do. So it looks like a violent one and a steadfast one make a heroic one. Long life, slow worker. Hmm, interesting. So it looks like all the different like bees have different traits, which makes sense. It makes sense. But like, I don't know, let's go over here. This is gonna be the last use of my scoop, sadly, so I can't gather any more. Oh hey, there's a little desert well over there. Okay, let's gather this and see if we can get something. Dude, I need to watch myself. Okay. Did I get anything interesting? No, I did not. Okay, so I'm finally back. And, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and check up on the car. What? Why is it going down? I don't get... What? Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is I really need to make some more solar panels. Uh, because th those are not running well. I really need to make some more solar panels. Make sure it's actually working. And, yeah, just get it going. Because I really need to make sure those work so I can actually use the compass thing okay guys so I made five solar panels quick update I made five with the amount of stuff I got I uh, have a stack of sand and then uh, yeah I got all that and uh, yeah so I'm about to put these solar panels and add them to my one solar panel and it will be what six times better technically yeah six times better we'll go with that so we'll put these here and then these should start infinitely running better. They're, they're still saying no power. Um, hello? Work, please. Uh, oh, wait, there's a honeycomb in here. I didn't put that there. So it's doing something. Okay, I'll be back with a progress support. This queen is, is doing nothing. Oh, right, it's because it's too hot. Oh, right, yeah, that's the whole point why we're doing... Oh, okay, yeah, I'm stupid, okay? Okay, we're almost done. There we go. We got a honey drop. And this honeycomb is still going... Oh, okay, I see how this works now. Okay, that makes sense. So... Crap, I need to go back up to the home and get the, the thing. Let's put honey drops in there. Then put the bee. Okay. So it's a wintry queen, so that kind of makes sense. Tega, forest, snow, or hills? Hills. Oh. So, okay, so hills. So that means I can take this bee house and put it in my backyard. <laughs> because my backyard is an extreme hills biome. Perfect. That's all I need to do, right? That should be literally all I need to do. I could have thought of that myself. Not gonna lie, because it's he's there. It's it's literally called a wintry queen, so that makes perfect sense. But yeah, I okay. Let's just put it in the back of my house, right here. Boom. Does it have clear path to the sky? Yes, it does. Okay. Is it working? It's working. Look at the bees. Yay! Fun. Happiness. Yeah. So, fun times today. But uh, I think that's going to wrap it up. So uh, we didn't really do much progress today. But uh, we got a little bit of sand. And uh, got a little bit of stuff to get started in Tinker's Construct. I, don't, I think I'm going to do that off camera. Because I made plenty of Tinker's Construct tutorials on my channel. If you just look at the Infinity S&P playlist. So yeah. But um, I think it's going to be it. Hope you guys enjoy. And uh, the bees seem to be loving these flowers over here. Actually it doesn't seem like they're enjoying it as much now. But... Oh, look at that, frozen comb. See? Look at that amazingness. So, I hope you enjoy. If you have any tips on what I should do with the forestry or any of the mods in FTB Infinity Light for 1.10, uh, make sure to let me know down in the comments if you have any tips or any ideas or suggestions for what I should do. 
Um, yeah, feel free to uh, suggest them down in the comments. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.